Hello everyone and welcome back to Sally Face. Okay, so we're searching for gear. So antenna. We have basically been looking all around but with no success. We could look, I mean, hmm, I think we need to check, because we did look in the lost and found, right? Yeah, nothing in there. Can we talk to you? Okay. Antenna, maybe I can find an antenna in here. Wait, look at this. Hey, mind if I borrow the antenna from your scanner? Uh, I guess that would be okay. Thank you, Larry. Hasta la vista. Thank you. I almost called him Sally. Larry and Sally. Okay, now let's get back into Todd's room. I don't remember where he lives. I think it was the second floor. Maybe? Yeah, Todd. Now let's see. He should be in his room, I think. Oh, no, 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 no. This one, I mean. Hello? Yes, this will work perfectly. With the two components you retrieved and my own equipment, I can... What the frick does that word even mean? <laughs> Make the modifications to the Gear Boy I spoke of earlier. Please give me a moment to get it ready. Okay, all set. Behold, the Super Gear Boy. Um, cool. Don't worry, you can still play games on it. It'll be only in ghost hunting mode when this, while this strange card edge is in it. Oh, awesome. You had me worried for a second. However, I unfortunately, unfortunate, ugh. However, I unfortunate, unfortunately needed a few extra parts from your walkie talkie and wasn't able to sal salvage it. I hope that is all right. Larry's not gonna be so happy about that. It's okay though. It's for a good cause. Wonderful. Now, for the best results, you need to hold the system out with the antenna fully extended. To do so, press the Y button, the screen will glow and it detects any paranormal frequencies in the close proximity. While it flashes, press that R button um, to reduce a large oh, discharge. Ooh. In my if my theory is correct, then the surge for electricity will provide an amp. Okay, I can't read this guy. Okay, I think I get the gist of it. I suggest that we take it for a test run in my bathroom. Sounds good. Fun. Whenever you're ready, uh, hold up the gear boy by pressing Y. Which one is R? Oh, that. Hmm, maybe I. Aw, dude, he's sad. Holy crap. Hello, what's the matter? Ghost of Greg. I never thought he'd kill them. I, it's all my fault. Who? Stacy and her daughter. Oh God, what a fool I was to fall for a married woman. It's never a crime to follow your heart. You must be romantic like I was. It's kind of you to say, but I think but I know better than that. We want to help you. Why haven't you left this place? We can never leave. What do you mean? You can't pass on? What's keeping you here? Have you seen a demon with red eyes? Can you tell us anything? No, no, no. What? What is that? What is it? I mean, he's here. Who? The red eyed man? The one who killed Stacy with her daughter? I have to go, I'm sorry. Oh, whoa. 
That was a fully formed and con- Oh. i never seen anything like that. You okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. It's just one thing to read about the paranormal and formulate theories and a whole nother thing to actually experience it. I know what you mean. It's a lot to take in. Well, we have some work to do. I think I've had my fill of excitement for today. So I'll stay here and do some research. I want to look into the history of Addison's Addison Apartments to see if I can find anything about past residents and about the supposed murders. That would be really helpful. But while you do that, I'm going to search for more supernatural hotspots. Perfect. Oh, and by the way, I noted, or I noted, pfft, I noticed some extra static around the game cart cartridge. You may want to check it out to make sure it's okay. Whoa, I can play with it? That's awesome. Hello? Members only. Oh, it's the ghost from before. All these rooms look the same. What about this one? Dang it. Okay, so first up, maybe here. Down. Damn it. Okay. Oh. No, damn it, Greg. Just tell me where I'm going. Right. Um, down. I'm going up again. And then, uh, left. Down. Up. Okay, here's where I failed. Um, right. Okay, okay. I'm just, I'm feeling down. Right. Oh. Hello, miss. Are you okay? Who are you? Pardon my rudeness, ma'am. My name is Greg Montage. <laughs> okay. Whatever. Sorry about that. Sorry, I can't know. I don't know. I didn't mean to intrude on you. It's just that I heard crying and wanted to make sure everything was okay. That's kind of you. I take, I take it that you're not with the men of this church? No, ma'am. That's for the best. It's terrible. What goes on in this place, it keeps me up at night. I'm beginning to fear for mine and my daughter's safety. I've tried to reason with them. I've only reached, okay, shoot. I understand. I lost my family last year in the big factory fire. It breaks my heart to see a kind lady such as yourself so broken up. I'd like to help however I can. You just need to tell me what you need. That's awfully kind of you, Mr. Montage. <laughs> I still don't know. I'm dearly sorry about your family. Please, call me Greg. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, this game is about Greg the ghost. Pleasure to meet you, Greg. I'm Stacy Holmes. You could have come along at a better time. You must be an angel. Just a humble farmer that's glad to be helpful to nice folk, folk like you. The pleasure is all mine. Right. So our goal is to look for a supernatural hotspot. Oh yeah. Nothing here at least. I wanna check in this dude's house. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't think there is anything here, but I wanna go upstairs and check on, I think, Megan, right? We wanna check on her, the little ghost little ghost girl in the 504 I think yeah hey doesn't it work anymore okay well let's check hey what why doesn't it work I am a little bit confused now because it should work here right okay well let's go down to larry's basement or maybe before we go i want to talk to todd and see if uh, he knows what actually happened to the thing hello 
I'm trying to find any records. Check back later. Oh, dude. Then I do want to check. Uh, what's his name? Larry's room. Let's see. Oh, dude, it worked. Whoa. Holy shit balls. What was that? What the? Did that unlock anything? Oh, yeah. A young occultist finds herself tangled into the bow. Okay, of the castle. Oh. Oh, God. That actually scared me. I jumped a little bit. Going up here. Ooh. Okay, okay. Oi, I almost died there, did you guys see? It's kind of fun, to be honest. These, these small little games. This one's definitely funnier than the other one. <laughs> with the with the rooms. Oh, dude, I'm lost. Oh, no. I think I need to find three people. Usually think all the good things come in three, I think, but... Oh, damn it, dude. I should be more more careful. That's not being careful, Nelly. Okay, okay. I'm doing it. I'm doing something. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Oh god. Are you serious? Okay, then let me go this way. Oh, dude. Oh. Maybe it's down here. Nope. Definitely not down there. Oh, hell yeah. You got it. Cultist, I have received the remaining assets. Very good. Okay, I'm really... Okay. Oh, is that the the dude that keeps following us? Question mark. Do you guys think they're in the bathroom of like every? I don't know. I don't know where I should look for these hot spot to hot hat hot spots. Maybe there's one in each floor. You know. Well, it won't hurt to just walk around like this, I guess. Is there anything in here? You think? Oh, dude. Oh. Oh my, what's that horrific device you have? It's, uh, well, it's sort of hard to explain. You really shouldn't tamper with things you don't understand. Mm hmm. Who would have thought that she was superstitious? I almost said, what the fuck? Superstitious? Right. Okay, we unlocked chapter one. Oh. Oh, dude, it's the same game as before. I guess. This game is actually kind of fun. Well, not kind of, it's, it is fun. It's very interesting. It's not like any other game that I've seen uh, or played or done anything about. Uh, not that they usually make games that are like each other, but you know what I mean. It's unique in its style and every- Fucking shit, dude! I was just talking. I was talking nicely about the game, man. And you kill me. That seems very inappropriate. I love the way the little walking animation looks. Pretty sure this is the old lady. Uh, I don't remember her name. Rose, I have- oh yeah, Rose. I have received the book of forgotten truths. Will you not- uh, will you not see my worth now? The console recognizes the great res uh, resolve you have been showing us today. Let's see this book. Stand as testament. Let this book stand as testament of your place among our ranks from henceforth. May our sight for we are the devourers of God. I see, I see. Ooh, I want to see if it does something in her room. Uh, Larry's room. Not Larry's room. I, uh... Larry's mom's room. That's what I meant to say. 
Oh, thank God. I didn't want anything bad to happen to her, to be honest. I kind of like her. Okay, I can't walk out there again. Let's go to uh, the second floor. And see if we can... I think we did in his house already. Oh yeah, no, no, we did. And no one lives here, I think. the hell um what yeah i'm confused too to be honest did i get a new game though or unlock no i didn't i'm confused i'll be honest but let's check on third floor david nope let's check our house i keep saying house it's just an apartment man man <laughs> So let's see. Gizmo. Right, nothing in here. Bathroom? Oh, shoot, he shitted. Damn, guys, I have no idea where we should be going. Oh. Again. Okay, nothing happened to the game. Oh. What? Oh. That didn't look good. No, it didn't. Let's just check down here. their bathroom oh yeah Todd made that that's super awesome wait is that my walkie-talkie oh yeah he needed the parts sorry I I went too close to this guy I feel very uncomfortable <laughs> um, yeah oh yeah he needed the parts for the upgrade I hope you don't mind I can get his new ones damn well that's okay Hopefully it will help to find out more about these goats and my curse. Agreed. I'm still pretty clueless on what to do, actually. Oh, I can go up here? I, I couldn't before. Is there anything more in here except that one thing we saw? Oh. Sal? Who are you? Are you Jim Johnson? You're breaking up. I can't quite hear you. I really, I sometimes remember yet. Remember the red ball. What do you mean? What are you? Oh, red ball. We're gonna die. Just when I thought I was getting used to seeing ghosts, and then that happens. Whatever that was, my life is weird. Well, I should probably check in with Todd again and see if he's found anything. That's true. Dude, this is so white. My poor little eyes. Can I have more conversation with Larry? Nope. Bye-bye. Well, I guess we're going to Todd's place to see what he has been cooking up. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever he's been doing, I... We'll see. Todd's. Hello. It's strange, but I can't find any reports for uh, of past murders. The only one that comes up is our friend Charlie. Char Charlie. I don't even know how to say that name still, but you know, Charlie works. But look at this photo of him in the public record. What the? It gets even weirder. There's no trace of any of the officers that were here uh, the day Miss Sanderson was killed. Not even in the classified police murder records. It's as if they uh, they weren't here at all. Like they don't even exist. How is that possible? I'm not entirely sure, but I find the find one thing. Uh, it's an 
Oh! It's a missing person case from 1987. Megan, Megan Holmes, age seven, lived in Addison's apartments with her parents, Luke and Stacy. Looks like, ooh, do you think it's the same Stacy from before? Oh, look. <laughs> I just, I, yeah, I didn't even read this and I said that. Looks like it may be your little friend from upstairs. She must be the daughter of that Greg from my bathroom. Uh, that was was telling us about the stories line up right well here's where it gets weird again there's an update to the report one day after the original was filed stating that the girl was found dead in Wendigo Lake that's a few miles south of here along with her parents says says that they've been fishing and fell into the river and drowned some kind of mudslide or something that's definitely her wait a second i've seen that necklace before i know i have she's n she's never wearing it when i talk to her but i've seen it somewhere else dude i know exactly where what where what where oh i skipped that oh i skipped that too now i just need to remember where the hell i saw that thing well i do remember because I've been in there that little box a few times now. Trying to find some supernatural stuff. But I think we actually can talk to Larry about the photo. Either way, we're going downstairs or down to the basement anyway. So it doesn't really matter if we do a little stop at Larry's. We're best friends overall, after all. Have you seen this necklace? Hmm, I don't think so. Though it looks a little bit familiar. That's what I thought too. I'm pretty sure I've seen it somewhere in the building before. It belonged to Megan. I'm going to find, uh, I'm going to try to find it and use it to summon her. All right, I'll come uh, with you once you find it. Sounds like a plan. I know where the necklace is. It's over here in the lost and found. I've seen it so many times. Now Larry will see Megan for sure. Well, let's go. Okay, work your magic whenever you're ready. Megan, are you with us? This is my friend, Larry. We have some questions to ask you. Hello. Hi, Sally face. Holy fuck knuckles. That's not a nice word, Larry. Ha, <laughs> you'll have to forgive him, Megan. He's never seen a ghost before. It's okay, my daddy says bad words sometimes too. Where have you been lately? What do you mean? I've been here the whole time. I've been trying to reach you. I think when you're alive, you can see the other side. Other side? Yeah, that's where we all live. It's just like this side, but a little different. You know any Greg? Oh yeah, you mean mommy's friend? I like Greg, he always brings me candy. Can you remember anything else about him? Um, just that he was nice and always brought candy. Oh, my dad didn't like him so much, but I don't know why. Ooh. Tell me about your parents. I miss my mommy. She doesn't talk anymore. What about your dad? Dad scares me now. He scares everyone here, but he wasn't always like that. He used to be nice like mommy. What happened? I remembered that they had a fight and then he was sad. Then his sadness turned into ang angerness. Ang do you remember your last days? I don't know. It's all blurry now. Were you fishing at Lake Vindigo? Huh? No. I've never been fishing before, but my dad went sometimes with Mr. Johnson. Wait, Jim Johnson? Yeah, how do you know that? That's my dad. Oh, I guess you're our daddies. We're friends. <laughs> Can you tell me where he is? Do you know anything else about him? Please, I need to know. I'm sorry you lost your daddy. <laughs> okay. I don't know where he is. It's just, I just know Mr. Johnson and my daddy left, f went fishing a lot. I'm sorry. Is this your necklace? Hey, yes, where did you find that? It was downstairs in the bottom of the lost and found box. My mom gave me that necklace. She was scared. She didn't. She said it would protect me from the evil in the world. Do you know where your mommy is now? 
She's in her bedroom, but she never uh, listens to me anymore. I don't think she can hear me. Do you think she... Oh. Uh-oh. What? Daddy's coming. He doesn't like it when I talk to people. I have to go bye-bye. Wait, I... Interesting. Shit. Yeah, they never seem to stick around long enough. Well, we're going to need to get into that bedroom. But it's all board up. Can you get some tools for us? Actually, David borrowed my mom's crowbar and never gave it back. Would you mind going and getting it from him? I've asked him like three times and now, uh, three times, bleh. I've asked him like three times now and he always has some excuse. Maybe you have better luck. Sure, I'll head down to the third floor now and see what I can do. I'm glad you said where he lives because I would not remember. <laughs> yeah. Hello, David. What? I'd love to, I'd love to lend it to you, but it's the only thing holding my shelf right up, right now. See, those kids next door, they're nice kids. All they have this real uh, party sometimes, shakes the whole wall and my shelf falls right down. Okay. CJ. Yo, what's up, Sal? Hey, CJ. What are you up to? I'm trying to choose the music for our party tonight. Mind if I have a look? Go for it, little dude. Yeah, I dig this one. This was my original pick too. Oh, hello. Hi, Sierra. What are you up to? Oh, hey, Sally Face. I'm come to play me playing an alternative for tonight's party. My friends and I usually like to do our own thing. Oh shit! I accidentally pressed the thing. How about this? Um. Oh, okay. Well, tournament it is. Oh, hello, pretty. Hey, Z. What's up? Hey, Sally Face. I'm trying to choose a game for the party tonight. I read a little book of games, but I don't know. Can I take a look? Be my guest. I mean, charades are quiet. Dodgeball? Charades. How about this game? That's my first choice as well. Maybe I should just stick with my gut on this one. Huh, you know... There's something interesting about this one. It's unexpected unexpected, and it's classy. I mean, yeah. Let's see if... Okay, we said charades to her. Telephone? I don't know. Yeah, the whisper thing, I guess. I think it is. Hmm, you know, this reminds me of grade school. That touch of nostalgia could be what this party needs. Thank you, Sal. I think that does it. Their party should be quieter now. Well, would you look at that? Hello, David. Wait, I can't? Oh, okay. I worked it all out with the college, college students. They're going to have a much more low-key party this time. Wow! That's great news. Thank you for helping me. Sarah would be so happy though. I'm glad I could help. Right, let me grab that crowbar for you guys. Here you go, buddy. Take care. Thank you, too. Now we're gonna go up to the fifth floor and we're gonna break down that damn barricaded wall door, I mean. Is it called is it called barricaded? I do not know. Should I use the crowbar? Yeah. Ooh. 
there's a hole here. Wait, hold on. <gasps> uh oh. Stacy, are you okay? I don't think so. To be honest, I don't think she's okay. Do we still have the crowbar? We do, right? It's just okay, good. Because I think there's another place. Oh no, not in here. My bad. There is another place. Um, I think it's the the not the basement. Oh my god, it's the uh, room. This room. Yes, let's go inside. Uh, of course, this is where um, the person died. The woman. I don't know. Oh hell yeah! <gasps> Mr. Chance, who are you? My name is Sal. I moved in after you died. Oh, I can't remember much of it. Just hazy pieces. Like walking from a dream. Do you know what happened to my Herman? He couldn't bear to come back to his room, uh, to this room, whoops. Movers came and took everything out for him. He looked totally defeated. You must have meant the world to him. I miss him so much. This cold, uh, oh, insulation, Oh. I wish I had never moved to this place. Then he could have never met them and Charlie could have never. Oh no, it's coming back. Don't worry, go hide. Goodbye, Sal. Oh. Wow. Now let's go into that hole up there on the fifth floor. Let's see what's in there see what's in there because i'm very intrigued by that hole that sounds so weird i'm sorry <laughs> i'm so sorry uh, okay there's a huge hole in the wall looks like there's a room in the other side should i <laughs> okay i'm holding the gear i feel a little bit scared in here to be honest not really but <gasps> oh Dude, I already know where this is going. H hello Oh. Okay, I'll guess I'll, I'll just play all these. Oh, we need to press the button, of course. And then enter. Oh dude, come on. Ah, oh, dude. Okay, wait. There's walls here there's the button good oh i thought i almost died oh god come on this is torture and annoying oh my god okay i gotta i gotta be more careful do, do, do. oh come on dude i will be able to do this okay let's go Ooh, that was close, I feel. Here we go. Let's see. Is there anything up here? Here's a button. Oh, we're stuck here now. Oh, dude! I don't know if I suck at these or... They are genuinely like not made for me or i think i suck <sighs> dude i was almost there chapter four stacy okay where's the power lines maybe down here Oh, okay, I get it. Well, this is gonna be the easiest one. Or maybe I'm lying. Okay. Oh, ay, ay, ay. Hey, back off. Back off, you guys. Get the fuck away from me. Thank you. This one is actually so fucking easy. Oh, get off. Get off. Ah, oh my god. No, 
Now what? Now what? Okay, now we're on to chapter four. Or chapter five? Yeah. Okay, I have no idea what to do here, but I guess I'll just walk down. Left? <laughs> I I don't know. Down? And right here? Oh, shit! I did it! Where have you been, child? You had me worried sick. I'm sorry, mama. I was lost, and it was so dark, and, and hush now, my sweet angel. Everything is okay here. I want you to have this. Grandma's necklace? It will protect you from the wickedness in this world, so you won't have to be afraid anymore. What about father? He doesn't have to know. This is, this is our little secret. Chapter seven. Oh, not this again! Whoa! This is way fast. Oh, God. Oh, ye. Dude. Who made it this fast? Who decided this was a good idea? Enter. The child will only slow us down. Oh, ye, 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 oh my God. Whoa. Who decided that this was the, the speed that this should be in? See? Oh, ye, 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 this is not fun. I feel anxious playing this. Oh, not anxious, but I feel, well, I do feel kind of anxious. Oh my God. I think I saw the button over here. Dude, <laughs> is that us? That's me. That's the kid. See, this is what I mean. They should have made this so fucking annoying. <gasps> oh, should I walk into the fight? I, um, mm. uh, okay, hello, Luke. Luke, can you hear me? Luke? Oh, wow. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wait, what, what just happened? What the hell just happened? Todd gave me one of his inventions. He said that theoretically it could overload and destroy an evil spirit. After I got it, I came downstairs right away to make sure you were okay. It's a good thing you did. So that red-eyed creep has been here for decades. That was before I even, even was even born. I guess maybe I'm not cursed after all. Yeah, who knew Addison Apartments had such a dark past? I thought living here would t <laughs> Charlie! I don't step Charlie? Dude, I don't know. It was freaky. Damn, this shit are nuts, dude! Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about the demon showing up anymore. Todd's thingy seemed to take care of it. Oh. What is that? Wh or what is it? No, that's great and all. I was just thinking, I guess, since there's no curse, this all means that my dad, he just... No, Larry. Oh, this is me. I do <laughs> This is so sad. Oh. Sorry, Sal. That's all. That's our time for today. The guards are giving me the look. Wait, that was only part of the story. I had hoped that to get some honest insight from you today, especially with this being our last session and your trial is just in a few days. I swear on my life, I've told you nothing but the truth. Government, conspiracies, demons, ghosts, and some kind of magical video game system. Sal, these things don't exist. You really can't expect, expect me to believe you. Think about it from my perspective. The evidence against you for what you did? Well, it's profound. I know how it sounds, but I've but what I've told you is the truth. Go to the tree house, please. Just go see for yourself. You'll find all the proof you need. Ooh. What a fucking psycho, eh?